Hey guys, it's me, the Sky Girl, and it is a Sunday morning at 10.30 in the morning, and um, my parents are asleep, which is really weird. They usually get up at like 8 to have breakfast, um, but I've decided I'm going to do a Sunday reset. I've never done one before, and we're going to do it today. So first thing on my list is make a breakfast, because I don't eat breakfast. Usually, um, I'm at work from 5.30 to 2.30, and I have a morning break for 30 minutes um, at 7.30. No, I, I take it at 8, and um, I eat a bag of ruffles, um, cheese, chips, eat a bag of ruffles, so... That's my breakfast usually. If I have leftover like Subway or something, I bring like, the other half of my Subway with me to work in the morning. Um, but yeah, I don't actually eat a breakfast. So I'm gonna have cereal with this as well. Cinnamon Toast Crunch is one of my favorites. Only thing of milk. I'm also gonna make a thing of coffee. Got some of my donut shot. Mocha latte, favorite coffee. But I'm not gonna put it in a regular coffee mug because my cat will definitely try to drink it. So instead, use these leftover Dunkin' Cups. They're small, very small. My cat's going crazy. Make some cafe. She's playing with plastic. My drink of the day, my sausage, and my cereal, and I'm thinking later, make around lunch, I'll have a, um, an English muffin with peanut butter. I love peanut butter on an English muffin, it's so good. Trash that. Okay. And now I need to travel to my bedroom. With our sponsored powered network, bringing you reliable, fast internet. Round trips and breaks. <laughs> Good. 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 Go. No. Thank you. procrastinating long enough voiceover on a here in the future so basically for my reset i started off with my clothes so everything from my laundry basket on my floor and i believe i took some things from the bottom of my closet as well and i just put those all on my bed in a giant pile and started separating so my main separation groups are things that are hanging things that need to be uh, folded and put away, things that are dirty, and anything that doesn't belong in my room. So basically right here I found out that Kyo had bitten my shirt, which was so fun. I love when she chews stuff up. 
So I went and fixed that real quick and it doesn't look that great, but it holds well and I've worn it since and it's completely fine. And next, fire equals candle, so I decided to light a candle. And Kyo really wanted a piece of that candle, um, but I did not let her. And I just went ahead and put that right back where it belongs. So another section I do for my clothes uh, is anything that I find randomly that I realize I don't like anymore, that I'm definitely never going to wear again, things that are damaged and destroyed by my cat, and just anything like that. And I just put those aside, and I also take out anything that doesn't suit the season anymore, and I just make sure I have that ready for when I swap out my winter or summer clothes. Now we're moving on to putting all my clothes away. So I folded everything. I usually do a much better job of folding my clothes, but this was just a quick little reset and not a full on deep clean. So we just put those away and then I started hanging up my shirts and my pants. And those are gonna go straight into the closet when I'm all done. So next thing, I went ahead and got a trash bag and just threw anything I could find into the garbage, just cleaning up my space a little bit. I also took any dishes that were lying around and put those in the kitchen. And yeah, so I just cleaned everything up. And anything that did not belong on my floor and didn't have a proper home, I went ahead and put on my bed for later. Next up, I decided to just take out all my makeup stuff and then organize it back to where it belongs. And as you can see, most of my makeup was already out because I had used it previously, probably the day before. So I just went ahead and started packing all that stuff up. And another thing is, before this video, I was actually recording a video that will be coming out in a month or two when I'm all done with it, uh, which is a cleaning my room video, but it's more of a deep clean instead of this super fast reset. 
Um, so I ended up cleaning my makeup brushes and my makeup sponges. The sponges don't turn out that great, so I think I'm just gonna have to buy new ones considering I don't wash my brushes for like a year at a time. So I know, not good, but you know, I forget and I procrastinate and all that fun stuff. But yes, yeah, so they actually look nice and clean in this video and I'm really happy about it. So yeah, I'm proud of myself. And the next step was my hair stuff. So I just put away my flat iron and I actually bought some new hair products like the day before. So I went ahead and put those away and opened up my new curling iron, which gets very, very hot. It goes up to 450 and I need it that high for my hair to curl properly because it doesn't really know how to hold a curl. It does now, but it's also just really hard to curl in general. And, uh, Short story, uh, I burned my shoulder with it and I now have a pretty great scar. So yeah, and it's still healing, which is just awesome. So moving on to the next section, I decided to go through my drawers and just put anything that didn't belong in those drawers on my bed and then just reorganize them a little bit. But mostly I was trying to find a home for some little things on my bed that I knew could absolutely fit into these drawers. Oh, and another fun fact, those Velcro things you see on my drawers, that's because my darling Kyo uh, really loves opening those drawers and going after my hearing aid, hair bands, and jewelry, anything she can get her hands on that she can use as a toy or just chew on. She uh, loves stealing from my drawers, so I had to get those Velcro pieces and just stick them on there real quick. Our next stop and our last one is taking everything that didn't have a home on my bed and finding a home for it. So this took a little bit of time, but at least I got it done. And yeah. Also the copyright YouTube video you see on the right hand corner is uh, because I was watching, as I always do when I clean my room, I was watching another girl clean her room and I didn't want any problems on YouTube for that. So I decided to just black that out. So I'm gonna say my goodbyes now, but don't worry, I will have a new cleaning video up soon in like the next month or two where I actually do a full declutter and organization of my room because I will be moving soon. So I wanna make sure I get everything out of the way beforehand and just make sure I only have what I use and things that I need. So thank you guys so much for watching. Please hit that like button if you like this video. Comment down below to suggest other videos that I can do and subscribe if you want to keep up to date with my content. So yeah, thanks again for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye.